<laughs> Welcome to Con Home with Jordy. This is Jordy. Today we're going to cook our my famous legendary afterburn chili. But it's a really, really tough thing to do, so I had to call in the troops today. And I got some help with me. I brought in Luke and Josiah. The one and only. Hi. 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 Okay, so we're gonna cook some chili. Um, step one. Kind of left the uh, step one? Dutch oven outside, so it's got snow on the lid, but that's okay. It'll melt. So I'm gonna fire up the uh, <laughs> the stove. Let the Dutch oven start getting the garlic. You can cut the garlic loop. Should we cut the beef stick? I have to cut up some onions. We need four onions. I thought you said you were kidding about cutting up onions. No, I was kidding about Luke doing it. Oh, you must be kidding. I thought you know how hard it is to peel an onion. onion. Not very. You know how hard it is to. Uh, never mind. Don't we'll go there. <laughs> when does the onion skin stop? Thank you. Do I have to peel the onions? Yeah, you gotta peel onions. I just chop them up and leave them skin off. <laughs> no. Dang it. And my eyes are gonna be on fire, man. Alright. Now, I would have just brought it over to the faucet, but pipes my froze. pipes froze today because the furnace went out again. I'm gonna throw a little bit of Mugs Rip Beer in there. I love this flavor, so I'm gonna put a cup of this in there. I'm gonna measure it out really particularly. Since when do you measure stuff off particularly? Since I got my size cup. <laughs> Since I got my size cup? You wasn't kidding, a cup of mug root beer. More like a mug of cup root beer. A <laughs> mug of cup root beer? Yeah. That's going to give it a really awesome sassafras base to it. That's cool, I like it. I'm going to put a drop of vanilla extract in it. One drop. Is there any vanilla in the root here? I know. Dude, how many layers is this thing? I think I got all the layers, Jordy. You want me to cut them up thin slices or chop it up like crazy? Mince them as small as you can. Mince those onions as small as you can. Alright, so we got water, root beer, and a little bit of vanilla in there. Alright, I'm going to put in some cloves in this water while it's getting hot. I'm going to put in the spices that need the longest to sit there in the soap. So one, I'm putting about a quarter teaspoon of cloves. Oh dear, the burning is coming. That's one quarter teaspoon of cloves. Hold on. That changed my gear. No. Woo! Keep that closed. <laughs> okay. Now, <laughs> onion protection. You can die without this. Okay. Since I am somewhat of a cheapskate, I decided to go with the cheapest method, which also happened to be the easiest. Canned tomatoes? Canned food. Beans, corn, and tomatoes. But I gotta get a can open. Unfortunately, I forgot the back can opener, so I gotta improvise. Oh, it can smell like clothes. Because they're weird. They like it. They're weird. That is someone's... a double-sided hand battle axe. It's my makeshift can opener, so guys, I'm gonna need some room. Oh, okay. yeah. Hold on. Are you serious? We good. I got protection. Wow, it worked. Oh, dear. Catch the ladder. You just stuff some stuff. Yeah. Oh. Now that's. That there is two pounds of tomatoes. Or did you put the apple pie spice in there? No, I didn't. Not this time. That doesn't go with this chili. I tried I was gonna before. say that doesn't. I need the beans. Don't forget the beans. What? Oh. <laughs> what? Oh. Jordy, you're gonna make a mess. Did he get it? Yeah. Am I safe? Um, no. When are you ever safe with Jordy around? It's... <clears throat> These are cloves. Holy smokes, that's tough. Well, it's advisable to have a can opener because 
This method is not only unsafe, but it's really unproductive. Andrew got a bunch of bean juice all over my cup. However, it's really fun. Oh, I probably shouldn't do that. Meanwhile, while they're getting vegetables ready, I'm gonna go ahead and get stuff ready for the meat. The caramel apples. Excuse me. Get some other yummy. What? They taste really good. I do. That. Sausage is good. Isn't it, Luke? It tastes kind of garlicky. I'm going to throw in a little bit more sausage because we need a lot of meat. It's going to be that day when your fingers are coming off. But he won't know until you When it looks it. like a sausage and I'll throw it in an accident. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Why open the package if you can just cut through it? Also, besides just the sausage, I'm going to throw in a half a pound of bacon. Half a pound. Right there. Could you have washed out the pan first, maybe? It was clean. I'm not quite done with the uh, axe yet. I need a little more room. Oh, Put some corn in there. Of barbecues habanero pepper sauce. I only want about one drop. Just a drop. Now, some Frank's wing sauce. About a, a glob. Maybe a, a glob and a blob. A little bit Just a glob. Blob. Blob. If I get a messed up look, you do that. You put it in a pile and go at it like this. Basically now you can't have a chili without ancho chilies. It can't be done. Oh. Two of those. Oh, that hard hurt. Probably end up putting in a third one later, but it's just two for now. Third one. And our ball of chilies. Now that this is warmed up and a little bit charred, I'm going to put it right in the chili. There's a bonus if anybody can figure out what's the difference between a soup and a chili. <coughs> a chili's better. <laughs> the spice is already kicking in. I can feel it in my lungs. Uh oh, my eyes are burning. I'm thirsty. Uh oh, my eyes are burning. Uh oh, I need some. Uh, hey, Luke, give me one of them thoughts. About half of a Jack Link's hot furious bee stick, but a half of a large one. Very, very weak. Oh, hit the wall there. Go in the other pot. It's gonna steam up this side. That's pretty good. Okay, I'm gonna put a little bit of spice in there now. Black pepper, um, half a tablespoon for these guys, a tablespoon of chili powder. That's good on your stomach. A nice swig of root here. That's a vanilla ice cream. Oh. That much ketchup goes in there next. I would be dying. <laughs> anyway, it's not I'll put in about a half hey, tablespoon of oregano. Rub some bacon on it. Da, 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 bacon. We're going to put in a good tablespoon of parsley. You know, when we make this, we're going to have to edit it and make it a lot shorter, because this is like 20 Well, minutes. obviously. A, a teaspoon of ground sage. I don't see any meat. And the same amount of celery seeds. Well, I'm going to add some more of those spices when it gets toward the end of cooking. That means you can go back to zombies. And then I'll put in my final ingredient toward the end there. So we just let it boil down a little bit. Let me turn this fan off so they can hear. 
let the thing cook. I'm gonna go to the bathroom, we can kill some zombies. Okay. I'll come back to that pot in about two, two and a half hours. Oh. <laughs> it's time to eat the chili. Yep, it's on. Yeah, that might be a little hot. Oh, yeah. Just a little. I'll get the ladle. Ooh. Look at how much darker it looks, Luke. Afterburn chili. Yummy. If you I need will. a spoon. If you dare. It's a dirty ladle. Give me a spoon. It's dirty. It's just mineral buildup. Close your eyes and take a scoop. Here goes Pepper the fries. He's trying to not get out. Good chili. It is definitely afterburn yeah. chili. I can't see it so soon. Ha, <laughs> funny. I got some nice guacamole here. A lovely reddish brown. And if you prefer, this one even has star shaped fruit. Starball. It's like a. Holy cayenne. crap. Super burn chili. Yeah! You I haven't seen it yet. Oh, you know, I had some uh, some oh, it's sour there. cream here, but it kind of... That's not sour cream anymore. <laughs> it's, it's quite sour. <laughs> <laughs> I think the sour cream has uh, sour. I taste the ghost flavor. That's all ghost. Now, um, I snuck a few things in when they weren't Ooh. looking. The star, <coughs> star fruit kind of helps. I put a few dashes of vinegar in when they weren't looking. Cider vinegar and I threw in a ghost pepper. Let that boil in nice. And then a little more black pepper and more parsley and oregano. I think my tongue's fogging up a little bit. Small. Here you go. Three, two, one. Cheers. Cheers. Down with it. You have to spoil. <laughs> Quote from the little rascals. Gosh dang it, man. Wow, I got a kick! Ah! <laughs> he, he, got <laughs> he got it! He got it! He got it! I know what I was feeling. Me too, I had a bad one. <laughs> what I have right now ain't as bad as the first few bikes. <laughs> <laughs> Kids, what we just did, do not attempt at home. Your parents will not like it and you will probably die. Sincerely, from those who almost died, including me, Jordy, and maybe Luke. <laughs>